Okay, so we're looking at Glyn Philpot now, and this mm -hmm. is one of his earlier paintings, isn't it? It is. It uh, is one of the paintings that typifies his work in sort of the early 1900s or the 1920s. Uh, he worked in a very formal style, he was extremely good at portrait painting, and he became very wealthy from painting the portraits of members of 1920s society. Okay. Um, he enjoyed like a lot of popularity with the academic establishment as well. So when he was 19, I uh, had his first work accepted by the Royal Academy, and he became a full member uh, in his 30s. So okay. mm -hmm. very popular, very wealthy. Yeah, and I guess it must have been quite soon after that that he met um, some of the other sort of artists that were becoming really big at the time. So mm -hmm. people like Picasso. Although he like studied a lot in Paris, had been studied a lot of times he didn't really show much interest in modern art until he sat on a panel of judges in the okay. 1930s mm -hmm. uh, and he met Matisse and Picasso for the first time yeah. and then he, there was like a big change in his work around that time yeah. in okay. the early 30s so we yeah. can go, let's go and have a look at one of those, yeah, yeah.